In this video, you'll get to know some of the best tricks to find square root of a number. But first, let's quickly understand what do you mean by square root. In simple terms, when you multiply a number by itself, say x into x, you get x square. For example, 2 into 2 equals to 4, 3 into 3 equals to 9, and so on. But what if you want to do the reverse of it, that is when you want to find x back from x square. That's what we call to find the square root. First, let's talk about the square root of a perfect square. Note that square root of a 4 digit number will always be of 2 digits. So keep in mind the squares from 1 to 10. Let's say you want to find square root of 5184. Step 1 is to look at the first two digits of the number. Here it is 51. This lies between 7 square and 8 square. So our range will be 70 to 80. Now find out the square of the mid value of this range which is of course 75 here. Squares of multiples of 5 can be calculated very easily by a shortcut. Always remember that a square of a 2 digit number which is a multiple of 5 will always have 25 as the last two digits of the square. So to find 75 square we'll first write 25 in the units and tens place. And to find the first two digits we'll look at 7 and multiply it with its next digit which is 8. So 7 into 8 equals to 56. This trick works for every multiple of 5 when you want to find the square of it. So if it was 95 then it would be 90 and then 25. So the square of 95 is 9025. 75 square is 5625 which is greater than 5184. So this indicates that our number is between 70 to 75. Step 2. In this step, we have to find units place of our square root. Looking at the last digit, that is 4, you can easily say that the square will end in either 2 or 8. Now we are left with 72 or 78 as options. And as we have already found out that our number lies between 70 and 75, we can conclude that our square root is 72. It might seem a little complicated in the beginning, but once you practice 3 to 4 times, you can find square root of any perfect square in few seconds with this trick. But how to find square root of a number which is not a perfect square? I have explained that in my next video. And if you want to know how to detect perfect squares, you can check the video for that as well. Got a burning question to ask or any suggestions to give? Put them down in the comment section below and we'll be happy to read them out. And make sure you follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus and Instagram and subscribe for more weekly science and maths videos.